All right, you guys, welcome to class. My name is Teacher Chad. This hour, we're going to be practicing our reading and pronunciation as we read through a handful of short stories. Um, the first short story we'll be reading through is entitled uh, Lily's Vegetable Garden. And the link, the link is in the Verbling chat box right now, as well as the Google chat box. Okay, and I do suggest opening the stories on your own uh, on your own uh, computer just in case there's any issues with my internet or with your internet. Right, so let's see who we have in class so far. Hi there, Victor. How are you? Hi, Chad. <clears throat> I'm fine, thank you. How about you? Very nice. I'm doing great, thank you. Nice to see you again. Glad to see you as well. Okay, we also have Sarah. Welcome back to class. Thank you. Nice to see you again. Nice to see you too. Uh, we also have Heidi. Hi there, Heidi. How are you? Hello. Nice to see you again. Nice to see you too. Um, we also have Enrique. Hi there, Enrique. Welcome to class. Thank you, teacher. Thank you. All right. No problem. Enrique, where are you from? I'm from Mexico, teacher. Do from you, Mexico. Do you remember? Um, I don't because you don't have a picture. If you have ah, a picture, yes, it's really, easier it's for me. Too. Yeah. Picture. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, uh, but I do. Uh, I do somewhat recognize recognize the voice. But yeah, if you get a picture, it's easier for me to remember. Yes. All right. Good to have <laughs> you here. You. No problem. Uh, Carlos, welcome back. How are you doing, Carlos? Hey, teacher. Fine. Thanks. And you? Excellent. I'm doing great. Thank you. Thank you. Um, we also have Amparo. Hi there, Amparo. Welcome to class. Hi, teacher. Hi there. Yeah. All right. Uh, we also have Oksana. Hi there, Oksana. Yeah. How are you? Uh, good morning, Chad. How are you? Good morning. I'm doing great. Thank you. And let's see. How about Ludi? Hi there, Ludi. How are you? I'm fine. Thank you, Chad. Excellent. Excellent. Welcome. And we also have Wilmar. Wilmar, how are you? Hi, Chad. Hi there, good to see you. Thank you. Okay, excellent, you guys. Uh, so the link uh, link to our first story is in the chat box. Okay, I'm going to put it in there one more time for those of you who uh, came in just a bit later. And I'll go ahead and share the screen. Okay. And we are going to be starting off with, uh, with Wilmar. Over on the right-hand side, and Wilmar, uh, go ahead and read from Lily Planted uh, down to uh, down to here where it says a "little piece of green," please. Okay, Lily Lily planted her vegetable uh, garden by care. She planted uh, carrots, beans, tomatoes, beet, and lettuce. The lettuce. Yeah. Every day, Lily went outside to water and weed her garden. However, uh, one day she was working in the homework when she glanced out the window. She uh, realized her profile carrots pots uh, were missing. Her tomatoes were gone, and her lettuce uh, was short, tiny, down to only a tiny little piece of green. Okay, very good. Let's go to the the, the word green. We're working on the gr sound now. Instead of saying gr green, okay, give me a good gr here. Gr green. Green. There you go. That's it. Okay, this word here is tiny instead of uh, teeny. It's tie. Tiny. Try that. Oh, tiny. Mm -hmm. Very good. Uh, next, we have an ed ending. Okay, this word here, instead of shortened, the word is shortened. 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 Great. Shortened. Great. Now, this is a... Uh, a vegetable here. Instead of lettuce, the word is lettuce. 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 There you go. Good, good. Uh, next, uh, even though we have a double R, 
Sorry about that. Even though we have a double R, uh, we're going to only pronounce one R sound. So instead of carrots, it's care, carrots, carrots, one R sound. Carrots, carrots. Okay, very good. Uh, let's go to the word window. Now on window, you added a T sound at the very end saying window. -t. Okay, only end on the O, window. Window. Okay, very nice. Here we have an ED ending. This ED will sound like a T. Okay, the word is glanced. Glanced. Glance. Glance. Okay, now instead of glanced, okay, this E right here does not make a sound. And the ED together, that makes a T sound. So it's glanced. 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 <laughs> okay. Now, uh, you're stopping right on the S sound, which is right here. You're stopping right here, saying glance. Okay? Uh -huh. Go one more step further. We need a T sound. Glanced. Glanced. There you go. Good. One more time. Glanced. Glanced. Okay, very nice. Very nice. Uh, next up is um, the word uh, vegetable, right up here at the very top. Okay, vegetable, vegetable. Okay, try that word. It's vegetable, one more. Vegetable, vegetable. Good. All right, nice job. Thank you. Thank you, Chad. No problem. Uh, next up is Victor. Okay. Victor, please read from What Happened. Uh, finish the paragraph. Uh, read this next next couple lines uh, here. See, uh, read down to here where it says, uh, "I don't know," said Lily. Okay. What happened to my vegetables? Lily thought to herself. Lily went outside and didn't see anything unusual. Her neighbor's dog Buffy was barking. "What's wrong, Buffy?" asked Lily. Buffy just kept barking and barking. Lily went back in the house to finish her homework. As the night went on, Lily's mom said, Buffy sure is barking a lot tonight. I wonder what is wrong with him, asked Lily's mom. I don't know, said Lily. Okay, very good, very good. Um, the only thing here was at the very, very beginning. Okay, you said happened. Everything else was great. Okay, so instead of happened, let's say happened. Happened. Okay, so what happened to my vegetables? Try that. What happened to my vegetables? Great. Yeah, everything else was awesome. Really good job. Thanks so much. No problem. Really nice. Okay. Uh, great. Let's go to uh, Sarah. All right, Sarah, make sure to concentrate. Concentrate on your R sounds. Okay. Okay. And I'll have you read uh, from He Was Barking. Finish the paragraph and read down to here where it says raccoon, please. He was he was barking, barking this afternoon too. I think I will go outside and take a look, said Lily. Just as Lily went outside, she saw something run from her vegeta veget vegetable garden skit ye yellow yellowed lily go away what what's wrong what what's wrong asked lily mom i ch i ch chest i chest chest Arakon said Lily, now I know what happened to my ve vegetables. Lily re repaced, repaced her vegetables that were eat, eaten by the raccoon. raccoon. <laughs> There you go. Good, good. Yeah, that word is raccoon. Excellent. All right, let's go to um, this word here. Instead of vegetables, 
Okay, this E, the E after the G is silent. We do not pronounce that. Okay, it's veg, vegetables, vegetables. Vegetables, vegetables. That's it. Very good. Uh, let's go to I chased. Okay, this is a long A sound. I chased a raccoon. I chased a raccoon. A raccoon. Good. Good. Much better with your R's here. Okay. Uh, let's go to this one here. So this is Lily's mom. Okay, make sure to pronounce the apostrophe S. Lily's mom. Lily's mom. Mm -hmm. Very good. Uh, next up is scat. This is an ah sound. Ska. Scat. Scat. Okay. Good. Good. Uh, next up is saw instead of saw. Okay. Uh, the a w will only be an ah sound. Saw. Saw. Mm -hmm. Very good. And let's see, I think, afternoon, yeah, everything else is good. Okay, again, really good job with your R sounds here. Nice job, Sarah. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> good, good, nice job. Okay, let's go to Ludi. Sorry, Yes. Uh, yeah, Victor? What does it mean, scat? Scat. Scat! Get out of here! Scat! It's a, it's a sound that we make to, to, like if a cat or a dog comes into your house from off the street, you go, hey, get out of here! Scat! Okay. Okay. It's just a, a a word that we use that means to leave. Okay. Clear. Uh huh. Good. Um, okay, Ludi. Uh, let's have you read from, but not before. Okay. Uh, finish this paragraph. Uh, and read down to this uh, comma where it says was Saturday, please. Okay. Mm. But not before her dad placed. To capture the raccoon, we need to make sure he stays in the woods. Say that once we catch him, well, call Mr. Joseph at the Preston Animal Center and he can release him into the woods. That's a great idea, say Lily. I don't want to hurt him, but I don't want him eating our vegetable either. The next morning was Saturday. Okay, very good. Let's go to, all right, uh, eating our vegetables either. Okay, so vegetables is good. We're looking at the R at the end of our and the R at the end of either. Okay, so eating our vegetables either. Try that. Eating our vegetables either. Good. One more time. Eating our vegetables either. Eating our vegetables either. Good, good. All right, next up is, let's see here. Okay, um, okay, release. Instead of release, okay, this is a E-E, -E, okay, long E sound. Release. Try that. Release. Okay, very good. Uh, next up is uh, the word great. Okay, so that's a great idea. Focus on that R. That's a great idea. That's a great idea. Okay, one more time. Instead of great, great, it's gr gray. That's okay. a great idea. That's a great idea. Okay, almost. Let's try just the beginning part. So I want you to say grr and push your tongue down. Just the gr, okay? Grr. Try that. Grr. Grr. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah. Good. One more time. Hold the r down. Hold the r down, okay? So it's grr. Grr. Uh huh. Very good. Okay. Now let's try and say the word. So it's great. Great. Yes, very good. Excellent job. Okay, let's go to. Um, all right, so um, a cage to capture. A cage to capture. Try that. A cage to capture. Okay, so this is going to be cap. Make sure to pronounce that P. Capture. 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 There you go. Good. 
And okay, last one here is the word said instead of say said dad. This is a short e sound. So instead of saying said, it is se said said dad. Said dad. Uh, one more time. Said dad. Said dad. Good. All right. Nice job. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, sir. No problem. All right. Let's go to. Uh, Heidi? Okay, yeah. Heidi, please read from. Um, and Lily Ran, finish the paragraph. And hmm, let's have you yep, uh, come down to here where it says a huge raccoon. And Lily ran outside to see if anything was in the cage. Sure enough, a huge raccoon was sitting in the cage eating a carrot that really Lily's dad had placed in there to attract the raccoon. Dad, dad, yelled Lily. There's a big raccoon in the cage. Dad ran outside to see the ra raccoon. I just called, called Mr. Joseph and he's on his way over to get him. Mr. Joseph arrived about 20 minutes later and said, he had never seen such a huge uh, raccoon. Okay, very good. Very good job. Okay, uh, let's go to uh, only uh, about three parts here, okay? So first up, okay, this word here, instead of huge, okay, it's going to be hue. So an eu sound, huge raccoon. Try that. Huge. Okay, very good. Uh, next up is minutes right here instead of me minutes 20 minutes okay give me a short i 20 minutes 20 minutes one more time 20 minutes 20 minutes okay very good and the last one for you is mister instead of mister joseph it's mister mister joseph mister mister good yeah everything else is great okay nice job thank you okay Okay, next up is Carlos. Okay, Carlos, please read from He Would Be Taking uh, and finish this story. Read down to Laughed Dad, please. Okay. He would be taking him to the Triago State Park to release him later that day. Lily's dad thanked, thanked him. And that night, Lily picked fresh lettuce to have in salad. This is the best lettuce I have had, said her dad. I'm glad we found what was eating, eating my vegetables, said Lily. I do hope Mr. Renko is adjusting well to his new home in the woods, said Lily. I'm sure he is left edge. Okay, very good, very good. Okay, so um, let's, uh, let's take a look at the... Uh, L sound. Okay, now um, instead of saying whoa, okay, the L in English, okay, we're going to go over two sounds, the L and the T with you, okay? So the L in English, okay, you want to pull your tongue forward or push it forward and all the way up and touch the top of your mouth, okay? So in, uh, in Portuguese, okay, uh, you have the habit of saying an U sound, okay, but when you say the word whoa with a whoa, okay, that's a lip motion. Okay, the L in English is a tongue motion, tongue. Okay, that bad boy there. So we want to say, well, ul, well. Try that. Well. There well. you go. Good. Good. One more time. Well. Well. Good. Okay. Now the other word here. Where did that? Uh... All right. So eating. Okay. Eating was the other word. Okay. So now the T sound. Okay, in Portuguese you say each eaching. Okay, it's more of a ch sound. All right, the t in English, the way that you pronounce this. Okay, your your teeth are closer together. Okay, and your tongue comes up to the top of your mouth, kind of like the l. Okay, but you're not curving it like this. It's more like this. Okay, and we say t t. So when we say the word eat eating instead of each eaching. Okay, like a Portuguese T, it's t, it's a harder sound. Eat, eating. Try that. 
Eating. There you go. Good. Good. One more time. Eating. Eating. Okay. Let's try this word is here. Here. This is from the reading as well. The word is night. Give me a T at the end. Instead of night, it's night. 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 Okay. Very good. And the last one here, instead of picket, it's picked. Picked with a T. Pick it. Okay. Now the E is silent. We don't want to say pick it. It's picked. Picked. Pick it. Okay. Almost. Pick it. Uh, you're adding the T there, say, or you're adding the E, saying pick it. Okay. No E eh sound. It's pick t. Picked. Pick it. Okay. Pick it. Almost. Okay. So we'll keep uh, we'll keep working on that sound. Okay. So let's uh, let's take a look at. Uh, a couple others here. All right, the only other one here we had uh, uh, thanked. Okay, this is an ed sound as well. So instead of thanked him, it's thanked with a t sound. Thanked him. Thanked to him. Okay. All right, getting better, and we'll we'll work on this e as time goes on. Okay. The last one here is release instead of release, pronouncing a z sound. Okay, this is going to be a uh, a uh, unvoiced S, so it's release. Try that. Release. Good. All right, nice job. Thank you. Okay, you guys, our next story is learning learning to ski. There's the story. And here it is as well. Okay, let's go to Oksana. You are next. Okay, go ahead and read from Lily Loved. Okay, and read down to here where it says, said mom. Please, said mom. Uh, Lindy loved the winter and all the snow that came with it. There was just one problem. She wanted to learn to sky. Living in Colorado, there were many sky trails. Lindy was jealous of all her friends who knew how to sky and went on sky weekends during the winter. Mom, why can't I learn how to sky? asked Lindy. I didn't think you ever wanted to learn how to sky, said Mom. Okay, very good. All right, let's take a look at this uh, word here. Okay, so this word, instead of being a long I sound, it's an E. So the word is ski. Instead of sky, it is ski. Ski. Mm -hmm. That is the sport of going downhill on uh, uh, in snow. Going downhill in the snow with skis. Okay. Yeah. All right. Now you did really well here. I only have uh, two other words that were a little off. Okay. This word right here. This is trails instead of trials. Okay. Long a sound. Ski trails. Try that. Ski trails. Ski trails. Ski trails. Good, nice job. And then the other word here is Colorado. Collar, Colorado. Collar, Colorado. Mm -hmm. One more time. Colorado. Colorado. Okay, very nice. Very nice. Good job. Thank you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. All right, let's see here. Amparo, you are next. Okay, please read from You Never Seemed. Okay, finish this paragraph. And okay. let's have you read down to here where it says, um, left out, said mom. You never seemed interested and you never asked. I'm asking now, said Lindy. Can I learn to ski? Mom said she would ask Lindy's dad and then her no soon. That night, mom and dad talked about Lindy learning to ski. It's a lot of money to learn to ski and to get all the equipment, said dad. I don't know if we can afford it right now, but all of, all of, uh, but all her friends are skiing, and I don't want her to feel left out, said mom. All right, very nice job. Okay, um, I didn't hear anything that was uh, off at all. Um, now here you can say all her, all her friends, and that would be just fine, or all her, like you said. 
um, mm -hmm. either way is either way is okay. Uh, but yeah, you're. I didn't. I didn't hear anything that was off. Okay, okay. really good reading. Okay, Thank nice you. job. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, let's go back to the top here. Uh, Wilmar. All right, Wilmar, please read from the next day. Okay, finish this. Uh, uh, these three lines here, and then come down to. Uh, here, where it says, um, okay, ask Lindy. Okay, uh, please, can I go? Ask Lindy. Okay, go ahead and read that. Okay, Just the next day Lindy came uh, running home from school and flew open the door uh, to the kitchen. Mom, mom, cried Lindy, the best team in the world. Uh, Look, is sponsoring a um, ski trip to the school, and and she gets to take five students to one to learn to sky side Lindy. She said, "I would be able to go, and it would only cost the money for the boots." Uh, please, I can I go? Ask Lindy. Okay, very okay. good. Okay, let's take a look here. So first up we have uh, the word asked. Now, in this word, the K is not going to be pronounced, and the ED will sound like a T. So instead of asked, this is asked. Asked. Try that. At. Ax. Okay, and now give me a T sound at the end. You're saying ax. Instead of ax, it's asked. 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 There asked. you go. That's it. Okay, very nice. Uh, next up is uh, the word bus. Right here, instead of bus, it's ba. Bus. 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 Uh huh, very nice. Uh, next is. Okay, the word said. Right here, instead of say, said. Okay, this is a short E sound. Okay, so this is said, she said, she said. She said, she said. Okay, very good. Next is the word uh, ski instead of sky. Okay, this is learn to ski, learn to ski. Learn to ski, learn to ski. Okay, very good. Uh, next is... Uh, the word through. Okay, a ski trip through the school. A ski trip through the school. Try that. A ski trip to the school. Okay, now when you when you're pronouncing that T R, make sure or sorry the T H. Make sure that your tongue is between your teeth. Instead of through the school, it's through through the school. Hello? Hi. Yes. Yep. Go ahead and try that. Uh, so practice the TH sound. Instead of true, it's through. Place your tongue between your teeth. Through true. the school. True. Okay. Now, this is Wilmar. Uh, uh, what country are you from again, Wilmar? Wilmar, um, what country are you from? Uh, from Colombia. From Colombia. Okay, the the T H will mark. The T H is going in this in this word is going to be like the theta. Okay, like zapato, zapatos oh. rather. Okay, so ah. stick your tongue between your teeth. Through. 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 Almost. Almost. One more time. Through. 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 Okay, all right, you're getting better. So just remember that. Okay, this one, this th is is just like that. Okay, just like the the uh, the theta. All right. Okay. okay and that'll okay. help you pronounce those words. Okay. Okay. All right. Nice job. Thank you. Thank you, Chuck. No problem. Uh, next up is this uh, Victor. Okay. 
Okay, Victor, please read from uh, what about? Finish the paragraph and read down to here. Would learn to ski, please. What about? Oh, wait, hold on, hold on. Um, yeah, that's that's a little over four. Okay, that's good. We're good. Go ahead. What about other equipment? Is that no cost to us, mom? Yes, because a special company is paying for the trip and equipment. Wow, that sounds too good to be true, said mom. Let me call Miss Lucas tomorrow and get the details. The next day, Miss Lucas spoke with Lindy's mom, and everything was true that Lindy said about the trip. Lindy was going for the weekend and would learn to ski. Okay, nice job. Very good job. Now, I only had two words that I wrote down. The thing is, is that right here you said trip, okay, but down here you said about the trip, and this was perfect. Okay, so we're going to leave that one alone. So the only one you had was cost instead of coast, okay? Uh, is that no cost to, uh, no cost to, try that? Is that no cost to? Good, good, just like that, mm -hmm. okay? Everything else was awesome. Thank you, Okay, sir. nice job, very good. Um, okay, so learn to ski, where are we at? Okay, uh, next up is Sergio. How you doing, Sergio? Hi, chat. Okay, now, Sergio, uh, can I have you um, take your microphone and move it a little bit of further away from your mouth? Okay. Just a bit, because it's really loud. Really loud. All right. Así? Um, un poco más. Eh, todavía le, oigo, eh, le escucho bien fuerte. Okay, así? All right, let's go. Un poco más. So so. Ah, that's a little. That's a little bit better. Okay. All right. So. Um. All right. Well, welcome to class, Sergio. Let's uh, let's have you read from. Uh, her dream of skiing. Okay. Okay, and read down to read down to here where it says the weekend, please. Okay, chat. Her dream of a skiing was finally coming true. Lindy and her classmates finally arrived at the Sky Lodge. They learned everything about the ski and how to handle the ski pole. Lindy went down the beginner hill with her t-shirt and a ski kid like she was skiing for years. When Lindy got home, she told her parents about the great time she had and how well she died she did with the lesson she learned over the weekend. Okay, very good. Alright, let's go to uh, some ED endings. So first up, we have learned. Instead of learned, the E is silent. We do not pronounce the E. So this is learned. 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 Okay, very good. All right, next up we have uh, the word got. Right here, instead of uh, when Lindy got home, it's when Lindy got home. When Lindy when got home. When, Lin when Lindy got home. Mm -hmm. Very good. Okay, next up is uh, the word beginner. Um, where is that? Okay, right here. Instead of beginner, it's big beginner. Begin beginner. Okay, very good. Uh, next is uh, the word ski poles. The ski poles. Here you said the skis poles. Adding an S after ski. Okay, so okay, pronounce the consonants that are there. This is the ski poles. The ski poles. Okay, very good. Next is um, the word arrived. Right here, you said arrived. Okay, this is a long I sound. Arrived. Arrived. Arrive. Okay, now. Even though there are two R's, we do not pronounce two R sounds. OK, 
Okay, so we wouldn't roll the R saying arrived. Okay, so force the tongue down. It's only one R. A -er, arrived. Arrive. Arrive. Uh huh. Just like it's only one R. One. One R. So it's a -er, arrived. Arrive. Okay, almost. So let's uh, let's try. Um, let's try a word here. So I'm going to write in the word rain. Okay, so I want you to try just the word rain. Give me a good R sound here. Rain. Rain. Mm -hmm. Very good. One more time. Rain. Rain. Okay, now we're going to add an A at the beginning of it. This is a made-up word. It doesn't mean anything. This is a rain. A rain. A rain. Good, good. Now, what you just did there is exactly what you want to do with the word arrived. So instead of a rain, it's a rain, right? And here we're going to say a -er, arrived. Okay, push your tongue uh, down for the R. Try that. Okay, arrive. Perfect. Okay, so yeah, push the tongue down okay. and you pronounce the R's. It does not matter if there are two R's. It's only one R sound. Okay, next up is... Um, let's see here, class. Um, okay, so here this is classmates instead of clicks. Uh, give me one second. Uh, Ricardo, uh, Ricardo, uh, please keep your microphone on mute. It sounds like you've got a uh, very... Uh, a uh, lovely woman in the background speaking very loudly. Okay, and we could hear the whole conversation. All right, so um, Sergio, let me have you uh, read that last word. It's class, classmates. Classmates. There you go. Good. All right, thank you. Thank you. Okay, let's go. To, no problem. Let's go to Sarah. Okay, Sarah, let me have you finish up this, uh, this uh, story reading from Lindy's parents down to the end. Please. Okay. Lindy's parent, parents were so happy that she re realized, realized her dreams of learning to sk ski. Uh, what was even more exciting for Lindy was that mm -hmm. her parents surprised her with a new pair of skies. Skies, skies, so she would be able to sky, to ski, <laughs> ski again uh, during the winter. Whoa, said Lindy. I never expect ex expected this trip or, or that great pair of skis. That this is the best time of my life. Okay, very good, very good. Let's go to, um, let's go to the word during. Okay, right here. Instead of during, okay, give me a good R. Dur, during. During. Okay, force your tongue down. Instead of du, ding, okay, letting your tongue hit the top of your mouth, push it down. Dur, during, during. Do, during, during. There you go. Oh, almost. We lost it on that other one. Okay. We'll, we'll keep we'll keep practicing this one. The R in the middle is a little bit more challenging. Uh, this word here, instead of again, okay, this is a short I sound. Instead of again, it's again, again. Again, again. Good, good. Uh, next up is the word able. Uh, right here, instead of able, this is a, able. 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 Mm -hmm. Very good. Uh, next we have. Next we have the word skis. Okay, now. Um, where did you go? Okay, right here. Um, in. Um, now you've uh, kept flipping back and forth. You said skis, then skies, then skis, then skies, and ended on skies. Okay. Remember, skies is going to have an e right after the I, so S-K-I-E-S, -E yeah. okay? So this is going to be skis, skis. Ski, uh, 
Okay. Okay, try it. Skis. Skis. Mm -hmm. There you go. Very good. Um, next up is uh, the word realized. Right here. Give me a good R at the very beginning. Rea realized. 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 Okay, very good. Uh, push your tongue down at the beginning instead of realized. Okay, R real. Realized. 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 All right, very good. And the last one for you is parents. Instead of parents, it's pair, parent, parents. Parents. Pa okay. Parents. Okay, force your tongue down on the R. You're saying pedents. It's parents, parents. Parents, parents. Okay, now let's try one thing. All I want you to say is pair. Okay, and you're just going to go right to the R. Stop at the R sound. Pair. 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 Uh -huh. Hold that R one more time. Pair. 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 Uh -huh. Pair. Now, now I want you to say rinse. Rinse. Just that much, please. Rinse. Rinse. Uh -huh. Push the tongue down instead of rinse. Ren. Rinse. Rinse, rinse. There you go. Okay, now I want you to say air rinse, air, air rinse. Air rinse, air rinse. Okay, go back to the R. R rinse, try that. Rinse. Rinse, rinse. Okay, now let's try it. We're going to say air rinse, air rinse. Air rinse, air rinse. Good. Now let's add the let's add the p. Parents. 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 There you go. There you go. Better. Better. Okay. So yeah, your tongue raises just a little bit, but not not as much as it was before. Okay. That sounded pretty good. Okay. Nice job. Thank you. Thanks. No problem. All right. Let's see here. Let's go to Jilly the giraffe. Okay. Our link is here in the uh, Google chat as well as the Berlin chat. Okay. Very nice. Uh, let's see here. Let's go to um, Heidi. Heidi, are you there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, very good. So one, two, three. Let's go down to here. Okay, so from the beginning, Jilly the giraffe down to without any problem. Please. Uh, well, a problem. Okay. Uh, Jilly the giraffe. Uh, Jilly the giraffe lived <laughs> at the Morgan Zoo. She had been there for a long time and was friend with the, all the, the other giraffes. There was just one problem. Jilly was so much uh, taller than all the other giraffes that she felt out of place. When she roamed around slowly on the hot days, she had to duck all the time to get past some of the trees. The other giraffes are just walking, walking along without any problem. Okay, very good. All right, let's go to... Um, let's see, just walked along. Okay, let's go to the word slowly right here. So, roamed around slowly. Try that, roamed around slowly. Roamed around slowly. There you go, there you go, good. Uh, next up is um, uh, the word taller. Okay, taller. instead of to, taller, it's ta, use an ah sound. Ta, taller. Mm -hmm. One more time. Ta. Taller. Taller. Good, good. And last word here for you, okay, is the word pra. Problem. Problem. Okay, instead of pro, problem, it's pra. Go straight to an ah. Problem. Problem. Pra. Okay. Problem. <laughs> yeah, problem. Okay, very problem. nice. Very nice. All right, thank you. Thank you. Okay, good. Let's go to, um, let's see, Carlos. 
Yes, Jeremy. All right, Carlos. Uh, let's have you read from. Uh, she couldn't help. Okay, finish uh, finish his paragraph, and uh, read down to. Let's see. Um, what's wrong? Right here, please. She couldn't help but wonder as she walked along. Why can't I be like them? I get so tired of bending down to get past all these trees. One day, Julie was chewing on some le leaves when she saw one of her dear friends, named Granite, struggling to reach some leaves on the other trees. I wish I was tall enough to reach those leaves, the, the other giraffe said, said to himself. Gilly wandered over near him and asked, what's wrong? Okay, very good, very good. All right, let's go to the word asked. Instead of asked, okay, take the K out, okay, and it is asked, asked. Asked. Mm-hmm. Very good. So, um, let's go to the word wa wandered. Wa wandered with an ah. One more time. Wandered. Wandered. Okay. Very good. Uh, let's go to uh, the other giraffe. The other giraffe. The other giraffe. Okay. All right. Good. Let's go to. Um, Next is, uh, let's see, okay, chewing. Here, this is chew, chewing. Try that. Chewing. Okay, very good. And let's go to the word all. So all these trees instead of O. Okay, remember the, uh, the L sound we worked on? To reach your tongue up to the top. All, all these trees. All these trees. There you go, much better with the L. Okay, and let's go to bending right here. Bending. Try that. Bending. Mm -hmm. Very bending. good. Good. And the last one for you is walked. Instead of walk it, it's walked. Walk it. Okay, one more time. Get rid of that E sound. So instead of saying walk it, it's walked. Walked. There you go. There you go. Very good. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Okay. Um, oh, what's wrong? Okay, very good. Let's go to Amparo. Okay, Amparo, please read from the draft said. Mm -hmm. And read down to here where it says, uh, need any help, please. The giraffe said, I'm having trouble reaching the leaf of these trees. I wish I were as tall as you, so I wouldn't have any trouble getting my food. You want to be as tall as I am? Asked Jilly. I always wanted to be shorter, so I wouldn't have to bend down to get, it, to get past all these trees. Oh, you are so lucky be, being tall. This way, whenever you want food, you don't need any help. Okay, very good. All right, let's go to the word so. Instead of you are so lucky, you are so. You're so lucky being tall. You are so lucky to be tall. There you go. There you go. Good, good. Uh, next up is uh, the word food. Right here. So instead of saying food, it's foo. Give me an oo sound. Food. Food. Mm -hmm. Very good. Okay, next up is uh, <laughs> leaves. Okay, the leaves mm -hmm. of these trees. The leaves mm -hmm. of these oh. trees. The leaves of these trees. Okay, very nice. And the last one here is instead of uh, giraffe, it's gir giraffe. 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 Okay. All right, thank you. Nice job. Thank you. Okay, went down to help. Okay, all right, back to the top here. Well, let's see. 
Islam, Islam, how are you? Islam, can you hear me okay? Make sure to unmute your microphone. Oh, he's coming back in. Islam, can you hear me okay? Okay, let's have uh, Victor read. Okay, Victor, please read from, uh, with that, uh, finish his paragraph and read down to here uh, from the tall trees, please. With that, Julie pulled down the leaves for granity. Suddenly, two more giraffes came along and asked if Julie would get, if Julie would get them some leaves. Sure, said Julie. I would be glad to help you get some leaves. After all, after all the giraffes had their food that day, Julie started back to the other side of the zoo to rest. She felt so happy and proud that she was able to help the other giraffes get their food from the tall trees. Okay, very good, very good. Only uh, one thing here for you is the word granite. Granite. Granite, okay. Uh, just like that. Okay, very nice. Everything else is good. Good job, thank you. Thank you, Chad. No problem. All right, last two lines here. Uh, this is for um, Sergio. Sergio, let me have you read those uh, last couple sentences, I think, and then I'll have you read just a touch more on our next story, okay? Go ahead. Okay. It is amazing that I wanted to be shorter like them, and they wanted to be taller like me, she spoke to herself. The lesson that Gilly learned, learned it, uh, that they was to be happy with who you are and to do your best every day. Okay, very good. Let's go to the word every. Give me a good V sound. So instead of saying every, okay, it's ev, every, every day. Every day. Okay, all right. Your your V sounds better, but with your R, push your push your tongue down. So instead of every every day, it's ever ever every every day. Ever every day. Okay, uh, you still want to pronounce that E sound? Every every day. Okay. Every 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 day. Yes, there you go. Okay, very good. All right, you, let's sir. go. To, no problem. Let's go to the word thought right here instead of thought. Okay, the oh. GH, the GH is silent. Okay, it does not make a sound. Thought. Try that. Thought. 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 Okay, there you go with the T. Yeah, instead of a K, it's a T. One more time. Thought. Thought. Okay, very good. And, all right, that'll be good for right now. Let's go to our next story. Okay, here you go, you guys. Okay, um, I put it in the uh, Google chat is all. Uh, now, Sergio, please continue reading and read the first couple lines from Marcus down to uh, Get Ugly, please. Okay, uh, Marcus was a pretty fun-loving boy, but only when he got to do what he wanted to do. If you tried to make him do something other than what he wanted, things could get ugly. Okay, very good. Now, this is going to be things with an S here. So things could get ugly. Things could get ugly. Things could get ugly. There you go. Good, good. Um, and Thank you. let's see here. The only other part. Oh, yes, the word you. Make sure with you, you're not saying ju. If ju tried, it's eu, you, you. Try that. You. 
Okay, very nice. Very nice. Thank you. Thank you, Chad. No problem. No problem. All right, let's see here. Uh, Sarah, you are next. Okay, Sarah, please read from Marcus's mom down to had some suggestions, please. Mark Marcus' mom was a bit old, f uh, fashion, 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 and uh, she she would be raised to learn many things. Marcus' dad was pretty much pretty mu much the same way they both believed that Mar Marcus should learn learn to do something other than watch TV and play video game games so they had some su suggestion okay now that word is suggestions <laughs> it was an s at the end try that suggestions suggest su suggestions there you go. There you go. Good, good. Uh, let's go to uh, his name here, Marcus's. Okay, when you Mar see uh, uh, an apostrophe at the end of the word and there's not an S that follows it, okay, it's still... No, huh? no right S. Uh, there is not an S, but because the reason why there is no S is because his, his name is Marcus. All right, and so all we do is put an apostrophe there, and the word is pronounced Marcus's. Marcus's. Mm -hmm, just like that. One more time, Marcus's. Marcus, Marcus's. Okay, very good. Okay, you guys. Well, thank you for for coming into class. Um, you guys did very well. Okay, I'm gonna wrap up now um, and get ready for my next class. I will be uh, working on uh, describing pictures. Okay. All right. Okay. Thanks for coming in. We'll see you guys. Take care. Bye. See you. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Bye. See you.